What's up guys, this is the AK Racing Core Series X. Core Series X Special Edition. That's what EXSE means, Special Edition. This is the Core Series X Special Edition. Hey guys, this is the AK Racing, as I said, Core Series X Special Edition version, which is just, the Special Edition has um, I think extra, a little, little bit of extra features, but it's the same, pretty much basic chair as the Core Series X. Um, I've been looking for a new gaming chair for a while. I have a DX Racer Racing Series chair. And for me, the most important part is how it feels when you're sitting on it, with the cushion. Um, this, and the, these guys nailed it on this part. My old DX Racer had the same sort of uh, cushion like this, and this is what I was looking for. Basically, it's not like a firm, like leather cushion, but it's more of like a soft, like it's like it's a little bit firm, but not like it's like a sink in type. See how I can like my hands like sinking in. It's got like a cushion and that's the kind of chair that I like. I don't like ones that are like leather or don't have, you know, much, much of a foam cushion. On top of the cushion, it has a breathable fabric, some sort of like carbon fiber um, fabric. So yeah, the seat's very comfortable. The arms, they it's just like your typical gaming chair. They go up, down, left, right, forward and backwards. They go up, down, left, right, forward and backwards. They go every possible way you can go in um, like, you know, Forward, backwards, up, down, left, right. Any possible way you can go in the this dimension that we're living in. In this, what is it? Four, something plane dimension. I forget what I'm trying to say. I'm, I'm a little... Um, we're not going to speak on that. Anyway, this chair... Highly recommend you guys pick this up. If you're looking in the market. Now we're going to get on the... The back end is... Uh, it comes with two pillows which is a good thing. The other one is somewhere around here. I don't use the back pillow. This is the back pillow. Very comfortable though, I'm, I'm, I would say. I like this head pillow. So the back is your typical micro uh, f same fiber there's a little bit of a it goes in a little bit before it, it goes firm now this price is originally four hundred dollars i would not really pay that but i got it for 230 on sale they have a lot of sales so yeah for 230 bucks in that range it's definitely worth it as you can see what i'm saying if you're if you're it's like the secret lab chairs are like five six hundred to a grand all those chairs, you know, they're they're gonna they're obviously more expensive than this, but if you can get this on sale for two fifty bucks, it's worth it. Now the the only thing downside for it's definitely a comfortable chair, like to just sit in, play games, you know. The two downsides are number one, the um the armrests are just they're they're fully adjustable. You can move them in and out. They're good, but they're just a tad bit cheaper than like the DX Racer ones. Like, they're good. They're definitely good, but just a tad bit cheaper. And secondly, it doesn't go as low down as I would like it to. When I, um, that might be a problem for somebody who's like five, seven or shorter. See, I'm, I'm six foot and it, I'd like to have the chair low. It just doesn't go as low as I would like it to go. Which is the only, which is why I'm, t I'm taking actually a point in, a point off for that and a half point off for the cheap, sort of cheap, I'd say, armrests. They just feel a tad bit cheaper than like something else. But other than that, yeah, we're giving it an 8.5. Um, special edition Core Series X AK Racing. Yeah, it's a comfortable chair, man. My, but my biggest thing is the seat right here. Like that, there, these are the, like just a comfy seat you can just sit in for hours but like i said i wish it could go a little lower you might have to use a foot rest or a foam foot thing that's what i use 
I wouldn't really recommend this if you're like short because your feet were not going to touch the ground.